हेलो स्टूडेंट्स सेकेंड पी यू सी बायोलॉजी इंपॉर्टेंट डायग्राम्स फॉर आनियल एग्जाम टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फाइव दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सम ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट डायग्राम्स फॉर द एग्जाम आज यू नो इन बायोलॉजी फ्रॉम डायग्राम इट सेल्फ यू मे गेट ट्वेंटी टू ट्वेंटी फाइव मार्क्स सो हियर आर फ्यू डायग्राम्स फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज लॉन्ग्यूटिडनल सेक्शन ऑफ फ्लवर फ्रॉम सेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इन फ्लवरिंग प्लांट्स देन सेकेंड डायग्राम इज ट्रांसफर सेक्शन ऑफ यंग एंथर or the enlarged view of one of the microsporangium any one diagram they may ask then the diagram of pollen grain or male gametophyte both are same male gametophyte in plants nothing but pollen grain diagram very important to the exam then uh, the diagrammatic view of anatropus ovule is also very important to the exam then another five marks very important question is megasporogenesis megasporogenesis or the formation of embryo sac embryo sac also called as female gametophyte if they are asking embryo embryo sac or female gametophyte this one diagram is enough sometimes in the in the exam they may ask you to write the diagram of fertilized embryo sac and to represent the ploidy of zygote and primary endosperm nucleus so this is a diagram of fertilized embryo sac then uh, the two remaining diagrams from this chapter uh, which are not so many times asked but they may ask this year one is a uh, dicot embryo and another one is monocot embryo monocot embryo is also called as embryo of grass from second chapter human reproduction either the diagrammatic view of male reproductive system or that da- 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 diagrammatic view of female reproductive system any one diagram is important for five marks another five marks important question is sectional view of mammary gland then uh, human sperm diagram also many times in the exam they have asked for five marks then for three marks either they'll ask you to uh, draw the flow chart of spermatogenesis or oogenesis from this chapter then in uh, pr- chapter prin- principles of inheritance of variation one of the five marks important question is mono hybrid cross or one gene inheritance or inheritance of height of the plant so this is the flow chart of mono hybrid cross then as you know uh, dihybrid cross inheritance of two genes are uh, the uh, in law of independent assortment is also one of the most important five marks question another five marks important question is incomplete dominance then also called as uh, 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 the inheritance of flower color in snapdragon is also very important then from molecular basis of inheritance nucleosome diagram is very very important along with the explanation then for three marks harshi chase experiment is important to prove dna is a genetic material another experiment to prove the dna replication is semi conservative is meselson stall experiment this also important for five marks then three marks transcription unit diagram is highly important to the exam then from this chapter one more five marks question is a lack operon concept diagram in absence of inducer and in the presence of inducer is highly important from evolution chapter there is only one diagram which is very very important that is miller's experiment diagram then from human health and disease either the diagram of antibody is very very important for three marks or for five marks the life cycle of a replication of retrovirus or life cycle of hiv is very important for five marks then from microbes in human welfare biogas plant diagram is highly important along with that from the chapter biotechnology principle and processes the diagrammatic representation of recombinant dna technology is highly important this chapter also has many other diagrams important for three marks agarose gel electrophoresis then plasmid pbr 322 diagram are very very important then this chapter has one more five marks question that is pcr polymerase chain reaction which includes three steps are highly important then another five marks question is bioreactor two bioreactors are there one is simple steroid bio uh, simple steroid tank bioreactor which is highly asked and one more important one is simple star simple steroid spark steroid tank bioreactor then from organism and population there are two graphs uh, exponential growth curve and logistic growth curve along with the formulas also important so these are some of the important diagrams from this chapter thank you